And we are live. What's up? Um, how y'all doing? I just got on. Um, so, so here's how we're gonna do this. We're going to uh, do uh, these boxes right over here, and then we'll get straight into battle. I'm going to link up everyone from the previous schedule. To so give me one minute, and I'll be ready to go. Um, welcome to the stream, y'all. Uh, folks, I just, I just joined. Um, we're about to get started very, very, very soon. Like a minute or two. So just go ahead and chill. Um, you'll expect these unboxings to happen first and then a battle. So yeah, um, that's, a, that's what we're going to do here. So I'm just going to get my laptop. Which is actually, how's y'all Sunday? I'm doing pretty well. And um, a quick, quick question for y'all is, what is your favorite bait blade? I'm curious to know that. Very curious. Come on. Clear studio. Oh, interesting. So, it's officially noon right now, so I'm not sure what's going on. But stream it is Can you um take connection? You all good? Is is a is the connection going on? If so, I'm ready to go on. Just let me know if you're getting the feedback. Now, unfortunately, I don't have any scissors with me today, so I'll just manually just rip the box. So that's what I'll do today. <clears throat> so let me get set up on the tripod. And get get going. Okay then. Here is two. Stuff right here. Cool. Alright then. <clears throat> Starting the video right now. Here's the official, I guess, behind the scenes thing or whatever. So oh. I don't know if the audio will be used this way, but I'm going to save my stuff. So, hey guys, this is Extreme Life here, and today we have two Beyblade Burst Beyblades. We have <clears throat> Revive Phoenix, and, 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 I mean, I suck at Beyblade Burst. This Beyblade right over here. Yeah, we have um, Chosy Beyblades. Um, this is Chosy, this is not Chosy. Um, these Beyblades are pretty competitive, as I've heard from many people. So I'm looking forward to opening um, Revive Phoenix first. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. But actually, before I open any Beyblades right now, I'm going to open the stadium. So here is the Bay Stadium, standard type black. It's just the black version from any other Bay Stadium. So there's that. So I'm right, gonna go ahead and just rip this apart. And show you how the stadium works. So, here we have the stadium. It's nice, beautiful, black stadium, really clear. I'm really, lo really loving um, this texture design of it. Really, really, really smooth. Love it. Loving it like McDonald's. So, um, here are these pins right here. These pins. And I'm going to open them right now. Oh no! The pen went flying out the date the table. Here are one of the pins right here. Hey, by the way, guys, for the live stream, go ahead. If you like the stream right now, give it a like right now and share it to, to your friends so that they can hop on the stream. Here's more opening uh, parts over here. 
It's, this is supposed to be in like a time lapse thing, whatever. What do I include here? What is that? And do y'all know what, what this is from the Bay Stadium? Oh, it's a code. I'm not going to reveal it. Oh, I see that we're getting some bad quality here. Oof. Um, I'm not sure how I can help with improving the quality. My yours is fine. Okay, then. That's good to know. I'm not sure what's going on. I'm sorry, guys. So onto the video, continue it. So here are the pins right here. So, so basically how it works is you take, you take one edge of the stadium and you go ahead and you, 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 put the, you put this side on the top and this side on the bottom. So how you do it is click in little clips over here and there you go. You clip that on the first stadium. And basically just do that like two more times and then you'll get your full stadium. So that's how you do it. And then we have this clip here. Go. Here are all the clips to the stadium, as you can see. All pretty, pretty tight in there. So here's the stadium we have. We'll do some test battles later on, but first let's go ahead and unbox the Revive Phoenix. So, give me a moment. So this is the, so guys, this is the part where I'm going to. I make some adjustments, um, try to make the Beyblade Beyblade appearance look good as possible. So I'm going to adjust the tripod and yeah, just see what I can do with this whole new setup. Because my whole new setup right now actually is is in pieces at the moment. So yeah. So anyway, here are here's the Beyblade. All right, recording in three, two, one. So here, so here is Revive Phoenix 10 SR. So here's the box. I, I really like the, the box design. It looks pretty cool. Um, this vehicle comes with a launcher as well. It also has the code here too, to power Tommy, right spin, defense, I think. I think that's defense. Yeah, it's a starter set, so good Beyblade. And onto the back, um, as you can see, we have, we have all the parts. We have part P, 10, and FR. I don't think I have any of these parts, so I'm looking forward to opening this Beyblade. Um, I, I also heard that this Beyblade has like two layers as well. So once you burst it, there's like an additional layer for you to burst as well. So that's pretty cool. And also it shows you right here um, on the stats, um, that this record is really long, um, longer than any of the other records shown. So this is this is um, a, pre a pretty good starter pack to get for um, uh, for your for our competitive Beyblades. So uh, without further ado, let's go ahead and open the box. I stop recording right there because I need to get good shots of the Beyblade box. Like. How you get like 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 how you get good shots of the Bailey box is trying like leaning against the stadium or leaning against something so the box the box can hold still and then what you do is you pan on your tripod as best as you can and then that's how you get your Beyblade shots or whatever. So that's what I'm gonna do. Mm -hmm. 
Push the back. And then get your shots from the back as well. And then what you do next is you go ahead and open the Beyblade. So, without further ado, let's open this Beyblade. I don't think I'm going to keep it, so I'm just going to rip it apart. Here is the Beyblade, all new and packaged. So, here we have the ripcord here in good condition. They're all in good condition. Here's the launcher. I'm, I'm really digging the colors a lot. It kind of reminds me of the Hasbro Spriggan a little bit. And then, whoa, what just happened there? Um, and then here we have the Beyblade with the, with the disc. So I'm going to go ahead and open the Beyblade and then do some analysis. Oh wow. That's pretty cool. Interesting. The layers, whoa. How does this work? Like that. Neat. All right, I'm going to go ahead and continue opening and then we'll get the stats. Trash over here, throw it to the side. Really. Record everything you need. Just throw on the ground. Here's the big blade. Pause that for video. And then, video. Thank you. Ooh, nice shot, nice shot. Check this out, guys. I like your opinion. Do you like this shot? Or do you think it could be a better shot? Spots? That's okay. Sorry that the, that the stream is really lagging a lot. I'm not, I, I don't know what I can do about it, but I'm going to continue to stream. So. Okay then. Here, here is Revive Phoenix over here. So as you can tell, it has two discs right here. Um, you can see. By the way, we're still recording. Uh, here are the two discs. I guess the frame disc and the core disc right over here. And so basically what happens is you attach them together right over here. And you turn you, you turn it the you turn it clockwise, I believe. Yeah, you turn it clockwise. And then and then once 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 uh, the Beyblade um, disc turns counterclockwise, then it, then it'll come off, but you, you also have to burst the uh, Beyblade itself, I think. I think I need to do a review on this again. Actually, yeah, I need to review on this, it works. Is that how it works? I thought that's how it worked.
are you doing that? That's really weird. Here. Let me go ahead and, and actually connect the Beyblade first. And then let me try connecting it here. So you take the beam off. Okay, then cool. So that so that's how it works. Yes, I was worried about that part. Okay then here okay then so here are the big ones. Part by part. So we have the disc and the core, so what you need to do is insert the frame, um, turn it clockwise, and then you have it together, but then, but then turn it counterclockwise and it's loose, and, that, and that's how you work the Beyblade. Um, I, really, I really love the design, especially the Phoenix car, it looks really beautiful. It looks like, there you go, like, I'll drive a little bit. And uh, overall, re really beautiful Beyblade. Here is 10, a pretty heavy disc. Um, I don't think I've ever owned this before, but this is really cool. Um, I think this could, I think this could be used as a good defense type um, disc. Now with FR, I'm not sure how you say it, but I'm not, I'm not sure how how to how to react to this part. It's, it's it, it seems kind of loose a little bit at times. I like the the really bulky bumpy design a little bit. It's pretty cool. Um, I'm, and I'm looking forward to see how this, this, this would perform, especially with the white ball. So, without further ado, let's go ahead and do a test launch. And then before we do a test launch, here is the launcher with the long rip cord, which is really, really long. And we'll be using this for our test launch. Stop recording, adjust the camera angle. Hope y'all can see. Okay, good. So, so here is Revive Phoenix with its launcher, and we're going to do a test launch right now. So, three, two, one, go shoot! Interesting performance from the Beyblade. So it seems like that 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 this Beyblade. Um, is is I guess a defense type in, in a lot of ways, especially with its white ball. I'm very interested to see how this would handle in battle, so I will find a Beyblade to battle with. So I think I think we should really try um, a kiss of Kuro, I guess. Or crystal cobalt, something like that. Yeah. All right. So here we have we do about. All right. So here we have a battle between a uh, crystal cobalt, or how you pronounce it, and we buy Phoenix. Come on, focus. It's working. All right. Then. So we will do a battle between revive Phoenix versus the uh, crystal coral. Um, we will do a best out of three match. So three, two, one, and three, two, one. Ooh, it seems like Phoenix won that battle pretty, pretty well. Oh wow! And the score is one to zero. I'm using the launcher for, for kids of Kodal. So three, two, one. Three, two, one. Ooh, stable burst right there. Stop recording. I want to see if I can somehow um, get a delay to make Phoenix burst. For some reason, I've, I've seems, it seems like I've lost some, my my rec my Requiem Beyblade. 
my ref my referee friggin' be I'm not sure where it is. That's kinda of freaking me out a little bit. Oof. That's not that's not good at all. Okay. How about this? We can do a battle royale. Oh, actually, wait, no, that didn't make it first. I think we lost one click. Yeah, one click lost. Alright, so here's what I'm going to do. To make Revive Phoenix Burst, I think we need to do a brief battle royale. So we're going to do Kotal, Zootron, and this Beyblade. So, our Revive Phoenix will be launched first, and we will have these Beyblades launched on a stream launcher. So, without further ado, may the battle begin. Three, two, one. So Phoenix lost that, that round, but 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 as you saw, um, Phoenix's disc uh, went off, and still there's no clicks on this Beyblade. Actually, yeah, there there is a click on this Beyblade. But yeah, this Beyblade is really strong. So I recommend it to y'all. Um, I'll definitely test it with other combos too. Hopefully sometime soon. Now on to the other Beyblade here, which which the unboxing should take really uh, should be really fast, but also we'll have a better test launch as well. Um, I'll tell you right now, like, filming, like, Beyblade Burst unboxing, um, it takes a lot of trial and error to get, like, to get the first time. So, I guess you can say this is kind of like the raw footage of, the, the, the raw footage for opening Beyblades, because we will have our... We, we, we will fail at some stuff, but, you know, we'll, we'll prevail. Alright, then, uh, I'll, sorry, I'm recording. Alright, then, I'll be recording this Beyblade. So, here we have, um, Oh my gosh, this is really embarrassing. What's the name of this baby? Wait, Hell Cell Mountain. Okay, Hell Cell Mountain. Alright then, so here we have Hell Cell Mender. Brand new box. Love the design. I'm ready to open my first chosen baby. So let's get going. So here we have Hell Salmoner brand new in the package. I'm going to take it out and then we'll do a quick review. Okay, here is the Beyblade opened up, and I'll do a quick review, and then we'll do a quick battle between Phoenix and Hell Salamander. 
So. Okay then, so here is Hell Salamander in its parts. So first we'll review the, um, the, oh my gosh, that's blue right there. Review the disc, not disc. Wait, oh my gosh. I'm getting, uh, I'm getting confused with weight disc and other this layer, oh my gosh. Okay. So here is the layer, Hell Salamander. Um, okay. Alright, so here are the parts, part, part, so here's Hell Salamander, um, the layer itself looks really, really cool, I don't see any mode changes on this Beyblade, or actually there is a mode change on this Beyblade, I believe, isn't there? I think there is, so let me go ahead and, and, and investigate, how do you mode change this Beyblade? How do you mode change this Beyblade? Come on. Is there mode change on this Beyblade? I really suck right now. Unless, oh, there's a thing there. Yeah, there you go. There you go. So, all right, guys. So here is Hell Salamander in its parts. So let's look at Hell Salamander layer. Um, so how you change mode for this dude? It is, there is a little switch right here. Uh, here's a switch right here. And you have to change it and then you're able to twist the layer. Um, it's kind of hard to twist a little bit. You basically have to like twist it um, the other way. Okay, whatever. <laughs> this is really bad. How do you switch this way? And then change it back. Wait, but move this that way. So. Burst is so weird, y'all. Like, I don't understand Burst that much. So here's Hell, so here's Hell Salamander. Um, Able right here. Basically, you, you have it in this switch right here, and you're able to switch the modes right here. It's kind of, it's kind of hard to change the modes. But basically, you just like switch around and then change modes here and there. But this should, but this should lock the Beyblade too, at this mode right here. So we'll have that. Here is the 12 disc, very, very a jagged edge disc, pretty cool. Then here's OP, a pretty OP tip, ha. Uh, and, and it also does change modes too somehow, or I think it does, I don't even know. Probably not, but anyway, um, let's go ahead and do a quick test battle between Revive Phoenix. And yes, right there, that was a bit, that was a bit of a loop bloopers. <laughs> for uh, unboxing Beyblades. Like, I'm not that good at Earth. And this, this life is kind of a risk. But, without further ado, we should be able to get a Beyblade battle going. Wait, what? It went further. Goes left spin? Not cool, not cool. Alright, so how we'll do this is Fafnir versus this, but this be left spin by my hand. So, okay, then, so here we have the Beyblades together. I forgot my left stream launcher, I'm not, I'm not sure where it is. But here's what, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna hand spin this Beyblade, and well, I'm not this Beyblade, because I'm I'm gonna see how good this Beyblade can really absorb uh, Phoenix. So 
without further ado, why is it being loose? Why is it loose? Come on. First Beyblade. How do you work this Beyblade? Sheesh. Okay. I'm sorry, y'all. Like, this is my first time opening this Beyblade. And seriously, this is like... This is like... Live blooper. You can tell. Struggling with burst. That's not how you do it. What's gonna break that baby? There you go. Well, this is a little uh, box over there. So, three, two, one. <laughs> Unboxing has turned into a complete disaster. Oh my gosh. Alright. Bro, how do you work this disc? How do you work this disc? This is so crazy. What on earth is going on right now? You know what? Here's what I'm gonna do. Or or did I just cancel this unboxing? I'm just gonna go some battle quests because like I'm really struggling with this set. Like, I really suck. But I'll get better as time goes on. I just been on a, on a hiatus. So, I'm going to battle requests. Um, I have videos here, mainly Hasbro Beyblades. There's no customs right now. I'm doing what I can with Burst. Um, and some of these guys are actually, do, are actually custom, but... Yeah, just let me know what, what y'all want, and I will get y'all the quest as soon as I can. We have Takar, we have Hasbro, um, Wyvern, all these Beyblades here. Um, yeah, but um, I, I would actually need some help on this, though. I really, I really do need, I actually do need some help, or, is that it? Bro, that's not funny. That's not cool. Yeah, you have it, you have it together. Like, it should be okay. I guess. You tie it like that? Yeah. I guess I'll add Phoenix to the list, too. So, um, yeah, that has a lot of Beyblades. It is. It, it's my, it's me, it's me in my basketball collection, and I actually have a lot of my parts uh, parked over here. Um, yeah. So those are my Beyblades at the moment for Hasbro. I've, I've been really collecting too much lately, so please just tell me uh, what Beyblades you want, and I will um, get to y'all. I can't do Lespin, unfortunately, because I just realized I lost my Lespin launcher, and I'm really regretting a lot of things right now. So yeah. So y'all don't want to say anything right now? That's cool. Yeah. Um, oh my, is a good word. I'm just gonna do some Beeple Burst Battles right now, so. Come on. We have... We have Onyx versus Wyvern. W2. Three stock battle. And, and to be quite honest with y'all, this, like, this is actually my first time battling a bunch of these Beyblades here. Has reversed at least. So yeah. Um, and yes, I do ha have a problem with Phoenix. It is. I'm not sure why my Phoenix is coming out so loose. I guess. Here, let me launch it. See if it's okay. It's okay for now. So I'm gonna I'm gonna test launch with this baby here. I think it's launched. 
launcher's broken as well. I wonder if oh, this launcher is gonna work too. Things are falling apart, it's not even funny. There you go. Scrumsizing versus dark. Okay, scrumsizing. Dark doom sizers. Okay, I can do that. So here we have these two Beyblades. Um, we will be battling both of them. So I'll be doing the best out of five battle. Or I guess I, I guess that's how it works. So here I'll have uh, Spriggan, Spryzen, um, S2 on the Trigger Core, and I will have um, Doom Sizer on the launcher. So three, two, one. Three, two, one. Did this, did this just break? Bro, okay, that's gonna really break. That's the first finish. So that's two points there for Spryzen, or I guess that's how it goes. Yeah, two points for a first finish. So let's go ahead and go to round number two. Three, two, one, 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 one. Go shoot. Who's gonna win? Who's gonna win? Alright, hold it. Make sure you don't break the launchers. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'll make sure I'm breaking the launchers. But, um, yeah, I'll be careful on uh, Phoenix. Yeah, I never knew Phoenix could be so far to launch sometimes. It's so weird. Okay, then, so. I think uh, Spryzen won that battle. So the score is 3 to 0. 3, 2, 1. 3, 2, 1. Here we go, here we go. Oh snap. And Doom Sizer is the winner. We are all doomed. Oh man. That was kind of corny. Okay then. So the score is 3, 2, 1. 3, 2, 1. Oh, oof. Team Sizer might actually have a chance to win against Spriggan. Spryzen. Okay then. And I'm going to have Doom Sizer the launcher again, but I'm going to launch Doom Sizer first this time. So the score is 3 2. Ooh, ooh, it's friggin'. Back at it again. Is Death Center actually better than Spriggan? Score is four to two. Let's see what will happen in the final round, or if this is the final round. I don't even know. So, three, two, one. Three, two, one. Go. Oh! That's a burst finish. Score is six. Sprite in two. S two is your winner. Um, any other battle requests? Sorry, this is laggy. I don't know why it's not why it's laggy. Excalibur versus Valkyrie. Um, sure. Uh, do you, do you mind if actually hold on? I can adjust uh, Excalibur. So our next battle will be um, Valkyrie V two versus Excalibur. That's what I have at the very moment. Where is the other part of the bait blade? And if I don't have it, I will just use what I got. Actually, here it is. I have this part here. And we'll do Excalibur versus Valkyrie V2. That is our next battle. So, 
I will have Valkyrie on the launcher, and then I will have um, Scalibur on the stream launcher. So, three, two, one, and three, two. Oof, Valkyrie just got a burst finish right there. Score is two, two, zero. That was tough. So. Oh, I think I'm going to chose you. Wait. What, what are y'all saying? Most duos will have a chance against middle feature 40. That would be cool, though. I would agree with you. And, uh, yeah, it's kind of sad that the burst people would are not are not that good against um uh no fight at all. Three, two, one. Three, two, one. Oh no. Do that again. That kind of sucks. Three, two, one. Ooh, Valkyrie is has some spin right there. Gosh, no finish. That, wow, that was another tough blow. Score is 4-0. Alright, well, how I'm going to do this is I'm going to have about, um, a scalper, Scalius on the launcher. It will launch second. Just to keep things a bit fair. Um, let me know if you have any more, more requests. 3, 2, 1. Ooh, hard hits, hard hits. Oh, that's a tie right there. That's a good tie. No, let's see, that's cool. So, just trying to put the back of the parts together. The score is still four to zero. With Valkyrie V2 is destroying Excalius. That much because just all these errors happen. Three, two, one. Three, two, one. McScalius is the winner. Scores four to one. Scalius will have to pull a miracle if it wants to win. All right then. Three, two, one. Three, two, one. Close battle. And Valkyrie V2 is your winner. Okay, who is next? Did anyone say that they want a battle request? If so, let me see it. Uh, request revivers, all the Valkyries now at once. Alright, um, I have two, maybe two Valkyries at the moment. So I have the Hasbro. V1 and V2 Valkyrie. So I'll be able to give you those battles uh, at the moment. I even have the uh, electric um, V2, so I should do that as well. So that's what I will do. So, gotta find some Beyblades first. Before I go on, uh, while there's one well, fighting my stuff, you can, y'all can watch or uh, Phoenix Spin. This is pretty cool. Okay then. together. Here's Valkyrie. So, here's, so, um, first I will do uh, Valkyrie versus Phoenix. Um, I'm just going to do, do like one, one round for each of them, and then whoever survives will go on to the next round. Um, 
That'll sound good. But anyway, hope this works. Three, oof, three, two, one. Three, two, one. Here's Valkyrie Excel just chilling. I don't know how long we'll stream. I'm, I might end this pretty soon. Uh, any evolution layers? I do. Ooh, and Phoenix One. So, um, Sunny, I, um, I actually, I, actually, I actually am kind of keeping track with some of the Beyblades, but I haven't opened them yet. Um, they're in, I guess, my closet right now, because I haven't had a chance to open them. But also, some of them are not being made anymore or non-existing for some reason, so I might not open them, I guess. So, um, this Beyblade is out. Um, and then next I will do Valkyrie V2. So, oh boy, this Beyblade's really trippy. Three. Two, one, I will launch Phoenix first. Go shoot. And then go shoot. Whoa! That was quite a comeback there. It's kind of pitiful. Okay. There is actually a good click. Actually, a couple clicks here. So, V2 is out. Um, um, my next, my last Beyblade I will try is uh, the Electronic V2 Beyblade. So, three, two, one. Three, two, one. Ooh. Light, but not anymore. All right, so there's your battle against all the boundaries. That I have with me at the moment. Yeah. <laughs> Check the chat in case y'all said something. Josie, um, okay then. I don't see any new comments right now, so I'm going to do my own thing. I will try. These. Wow. Um, these bits versus Phoenix. That's all I'll do. So, three, two, one. Three, two, one. at the moment. So. Gosh, I hate this Beyblade. I want to like, throw it out the window right now. It's like, it's causing so much trouble already. There you go. And where is the other part? Where is the other part? Oh, it is. So. Three, two, 
one. somehow prevails with just one click. Eesh. Oh, it's my comment. Sorry, I've been reading comments too much. Uh, right um, how long my stream will last? Um, I thought I answered. Basically, my stream. I think I think after this battle I'm gonna go. Um, the last battle quest. Um, Requiem is bloody long enough. I really wish I had um, both Beyblades with me at the moment, but I don't. Um, but hopefully maybe next stream or next few streams I can provide you with those two Beyblades. But the last one I'm gonna do with my stream. Um. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna finish the battle royal that I have, and then I'm gonna sign out. So three, without this frame falling apart. Jeez. Three. Okay, it's still it's still. Three, two, one. <laughs> Are you Phoenix? Come on. Okay, it's on. Don't fall apart. This is this is why I like Metal Fight better than Burst. Because these issues don't happen. Three, two, one. You know what? Screw the frame. I'm gonna do this paper by itself. That's how I'm gonna do it. Three, two, one. Go. I'm gonna go. Um, yeah, thanks for being a stream. Despite what happened, we somehow still prevailed by barely. Um, thanks for watching. <laughs>